I want to speak to you today about getting to know the heart of God. When you get to know the heart of God, it will trans transform your life. It will change you. You'll begin to walk with God in a whole new way, in a whole fresh way. Not only will it change you, but it will change the people around you and the people that you love and that you care about. Uh, it, it'll make all the difference in the world when you get to know the heart of God. Now, how do you get to know his heart and what's on his heart? First John chapter four tells us what's on the heart of God. It says that it wasn't that we first loved God. That's not why I'm doing what I'm doing. That's not why you're watching these videos. That's not why any, any of us are serving the Lord. It wasn't that we first loved God, but it was that God first loved us and sent his only begotten son, that we, we could have the forgiveness of sin, that we can know a holy God, that we could come into his presence. You see, it's God's great love for us. The more I understand how much he loves me and how much he loves you, the, the more it changes my life. And because it, it makes me want to love others and to reach out to others and share the love of God with others. There's so many people who need Jesus. And so God wants us sharing his love with other people. So we need to get to know the heart of God. You know, there's a wonderful story about a great evangelist by the name of D.L. Moody, one of my favorite evangelists. And, and D.L. Moody, a, a guy from Scotland came over and preached in Mr. Moody's church. He wasn't there. And when he came home, his wife told him, she said, well, uh, he preached tonight and I don't think you're going to like what he preached. And Mr. Moody said, what, what did he preach? She said, he preached that God loves all people. And, and he said, no, that's not true. He ate sinners. He said, well, he started in the book of Genesis and he just walked through the Bible and showed how God loves all people. And Mr. Moody said, well, he was really happy about it. And so he went and heard him the next night. And the man took the scripture and opened the Bible and showed from the Old Testament to the New Testament God's great love for sinners, for people who are, who are lost and separated from a holy God and how he loves us so much that he sent Jesus to die for us. Mr. Moody's life was transformed and he became one of the greatest evangelists in, in all of modern history. And God used Mr. Moody in a mighty way. He put one foot on North America and one foot on Western Europe. And he shook the continents for the glory of God. And he had placed at the back of his church these words. God is love. Mr. Moody got to know the heart of God. Why don't you spend time in his word, in prayer, saying, God I want to get to know you and what's on your heart. You'll come out changed.